Welcome to Hadoop Exam Learning Resources. In this session, we'll be discussing problem scenario number nine from the simulator, and we will execute it. Okay, so let's go to the simulator. So this is the simulator. Now we have total 75 scenario-based questions as of now. Uh, in version, you can check the version here 110, and similarly here. Okay, so now uh, how to go to question nine? You can use the next and previous button, or directly from this uh, here you can. Select question nine. So we have nine questions. What this problem is saying, you already have two tables uh, in the hive schema. Okay, they are talking about sample underscore zero seven sample zero eight in a default schema with the following structure. Both tables have the same structure. Okay, sample zero seven and sample zero eight. The code is the string. Description is a string. Total employee is integer and salaries. Create another table named employee hundred k two in a family schema. Now they are talking about the change the schema, which has all the employees whose salary is greater than hundred thousand from both the tables. Now you have to you have two tables. You have to apply predicate and the result needs to be in the same table. So you need we need to write a hive query. Simply it's a query. Actually this is. Uh, Uh, we are just getting introduced with the hive here uh, exactly so they might not ask directly the using the query that could be an entire problem and in which you can you have to use the query however they are more focusing on the ddl side so like defining the tables and all this so it's a just an introductory part some basic understanding of hive query you need to know uh, for uh, appearing the exam so that's the reason this question have been added here so we would have two three questions on hive query based not too much focus we need on the hive query okay for this particular cca 175 exam so let's go to the uh, sim uh, virtual machines like this is cloud or virtual machine uh, there are two way to you can you use the hive query the one is the spark shell uh, sorry not spark shell simple terminal and you just type hive so it will move into the default schema okay and uh, let it get started okay so we have query here so what this query is doing like we need to create table in the family schema okay so either we should have a family schema already created if don't then then we have to create it so that's the, the part of uh, uh, your so that is the part of ddl okay so now you have to define schema and create table inside this okay so this is two things here like we need to use family dot so normal rdbms things we are doing same signature create table as using so this is used mixed approach correct you are using the query as well as ddl you are defining new table that is the requirement uh, it's mentioned in the syllabus you have should be able to create the table in hive schema okay so we need to first create the schema uh, uh, family schema and then create table inside the, the schema employee 100k2 we have to create it so and use we want to union the data because we want to select data from both the tables like select start from sample 07 valerie where salary is greater than equal to 100000 similarly from the second table so you could have in your schema multiple tables so this is data set 1 and this is data set 2 as with clause we have used here so with clause help you to query the multiple query and store temp kind of this is temporary table data set 1 which has the selected data from this query similarly data set 2 is another table which has selected data from this so similarly you can have multiple data set even you could have one more data set here uh, okay so this we, we could be having a multiple data set here so now let's uh, uh, use this query uh, here uh, and uh, we could use either hive or uh, hue to this so let's go to this hive and uh, show schema sorry we have to use sim semicolon uh, show schemas or something yes i missed the s here so so schemas we have default family and hadoop exam three schema okay so let me drop family schema drop data base name family yes 
some error I must the job sorry okay so th this is not empty so we have let's go to use family I'm going to use this because uh, you might have to do in real exam this thing okay so use family so now we are in the uh, family schema show papers so we will be using show table so we have already experimented so there are tables available so let me drop this table drop table and table name employee 100 k okay similarly i'll drop this table once that is done copy drop table and table name family hat so now we have uh, uh, removed all the tables so show tables it should not show any table okay so now let's drop schema in database uh, name is family okay so now we have show schema so we don't have a swiss family schema okay so now create database again we have to create the database okay database uh, name of uh, family so now we have created the database so uh, database is so we have family database so use family database okay so now we have show tables here so I prefer to use the command because you can uh, learn more on this. So let me add this part. Uh, okay. Uh, sorry, just a minute. So now we are in the family database. Okay. Uh, show tables. It should not show anything. So now using this query which we have created create table so this is the temporary table data set do two temporary table and using this really data set one and data set two like select star from data set one and union all select star from data set two and we'll create the table in the family schema okay so let's copy this command yeah so if you don't know that too much on with clause please read this this is very helpful even this is available in rdbms so you must be aware about this okay uh, so there's a space okay so let me remove this space this space is creating the problem i just for the indentation purpose i have added this space but uh, high command line don't accept this so let's come out of this what is happening so now we have copied this command create table family or uh, is this and just press the enter so this is failed uh, sample 0 7 is definition of ct data 7 1 something wrong here mm okay just a minute okay table not found okay oh sorry we are already in the family schema okay and family schema does not have this table we have this table in the default schema so let's come out of the schema use default schema instead of family schema show schemas okay so this kind of mistakes we have to avoid in the real exam so it could be faster that's the reason i'm asking you to practice as much as possible okay so go to uh, use default schema okay and then now let me paste the query here and it should able to create now okay so now 
uh, there's no reduce operator so the, you can see like hive uses the map reduce functions and it will create the map reduce so generally it don't requires the reduce function until and unless you have a join a, a group by operation or something then there is no there so it is running the job here okay so there are two mappers would be created so 0% mapper and 0% reducer okay so let it let it get finished and then once this job is finished we should have the table inside the schema so we can using this query we can get the uh, data uh, once created in the table okay so let's wait it to get finished so this is a virtual machine so a little bit slower however we have finished the map part and it is uh, again started another job uh, for the I don't know like actually what uh, individually uh, mappers are doing inside this so there could be like multiple jobs can be created by the hive to run it in the background for your query so you see like relatively it is a slower why uh, we compare to rdbms but there's no need like this is not a replacement of rdbms correct this is the, for huge data set so don't compare it with the rdbms okay so now let's just query it select star family so now this is the fourth column which is our salary here uh, so which is a uh, and more than hundred thousand okay so the all the salary column is more than hundred thousand so that is the indentations reasons the column are uh, not showing properly okay so that's all and then let's go to the hue schema and check the data okay so just to open the browser uh, using the hue we'll go to the hive and uh, query it from here let's see what happens just a minute uh, let it get launched go to the hive so you please get acquainted with the all the available tools in the quick uh, quick start vm because the same would be available in your real exam okay uh, sorry okay so now let's fire the query here execute so we have added the uh, family schema here okay so this is our data and last column is the salary here you have col uh, column information as well so this is our data set okay so that's where we can create the table from the existing table so we sh we are using actually we here we are doing ddl plus da not dml actually we are just creating the table using the existing table so that's all about this so we have now uh, you can watch this uh, videos from cca 175 cloud training for exam.com and i would suggest if you're watching this video on youtube please don't forget to subscribe it because uh, once you subscribe it whenever we add new video you will get the notification so that is very important for you to subscribe on youtube so we could have placed a few videos on youtube to get uh, 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 you you get to know about this uh, new releases uh, as per fast as possible so that is about the assignment 9 okay so we'll be doing the more uh, even it is not necessary watch all the videos you just read the problem statement we have given the solutions uh, if you don't have too much time to watch all the video but if you find difficulty in any particular video so i would suggest you go to all the videos if you have time because we uh, sometimes discuss the, some concept as well in the video so thanks thanks for watching actually and i hope you like it and don't forget our hadoop exam.com keep uh, watching it we are keep adding the sessions here so we have hadoop spark training here we have added few more sessions related to api and spark streaming and all these things we are adding it so we will be keep adding the sessions more and more and please don't forget to refer your friend about this thank you thanks for watching it